everyone, it's Rita from Rita's Witchcraft. How are you guys doing today? I've got a Timu haul, a fairly big one. So I've got lots of cool things inside here. Uh, really lots of different stuff. And I'll talk about the deals that I'm getting on Timu and um, hopefully you can get the same deals. They're, all of this I've brought myself. I, yeah, not sponsored. I have not been sponsored at all uh, in any of my videos that I've done, um, but I just like buying from AliExpress and Timu. Timu, I took a little bit of a back step from because they've stopped the games and um, they, they kind of, I feel like when you go and buy things on, on the wheels that they send you a, a wheel to spin every day and um, they say, oh, you, you can buy, you know, you can get this item for free, but, and then you'll get some coupons. And when you go and buy, you know, 50 euro worth of stuff or 100 euro worth of stuff, you get the coupons, but then the coupons are split. So I, you know, I purchased 100, sorry, I, purchased, I spent 50 euro and I was supposed to get 100 euro worth of coupons. They don't give you 100 euro worth of coupons, or they do, but you, you get them in, okay, you got a $10 euro, but you've got to spend 89 euro. You get a $20 euro, but you've got to spend 169 euro. So to me, that is a bit deceiving. Um, so I'm a little bit annoyed to, about that with Timu. Um, having said that, I've brought this in, in that same deal, but only because I don't really care about the coupons that I'm going to get. I just care that they gave me some free items and I'll show you what I got and why I ended up buying them. So in the end, for me, it was worth it. Um, and so, but I don't like the deceit that they you know, try to tempt you with, and, and I don't like that. I, I don't, I think that's really unfair that they do that. Be honest and say, okay, you're going to get varying amount of, of coupons. Um, but they, the other problem is you've got to use them straight away. Well, you've just spent, you know, 50 to 100 euro of stuff. You're not going to then go and buy, use up those coupons to buy them. Now, that was stupid of me wanting to get the coupons. Um, so, yeah, I I suppose I did it because they gave me some free items at the start. So that's why I brought it, not necessarily for the coupons. Anyway, no more whinging about them because I do like them. I think they're a great company. I think the products have been amazing. It's pretty rare that I find something that I don't like. Um, having said that, there is one in here, which I'll show you. Uh, and also, I really like... Um, that they've got a 90 day return. So if you, particularly if you're buying clothes, you have no problem sending them back. They always give you your refund back um, and there's no, never an issue. It's really easy to get your money back. So I really like that. So having said that, let me, let me have a look at what, I, let me show you what I've got. Okay, let me open this back now. I have opened it, but I haven't actually opened the items. I've just, Price them, so I have no idea what the quality is like. It's just so the first one is inside the bag, so I haven't actually physically opened these things. So hopefully that stays there. Now this one was one of my free items, so I got it for free, and this is what tempted me to buy um, to to go for that deal. So this is actually so we brought some new e-bikes. So these are. This goes over the, the what do you call it? The thing that goes at the back of the bike. And then this sits on it. So, and then this can be my shopping. Like when we go shopping, I can pile some stuff in there. And this was about 25 euro and I got it for free. So I thought, well, if I'm spending 50, if I have to pay an extra 50 and I get this included, well, that's worth it. So... I think this is pretty, pretty good for this for what I paid. So I'm super happy. That's why I actually went for it this time. I thought, yeah, okay, I'm happy to to, to pay for this. So the zippers are all beautifully working. They they've got it's quite a big bag. This is pretty big. So it's got two on each side, and I love it. It's got the little reflecto thing. So when you're on the bike. 
this especially if you're traveling a little bit later at night it's going to be a reflective so it's on both sides so they can also see that sort of that smash into because they get pretty close so they don't smash into my bike which is awesome so very happy with this super happy i'll put the links down below there's not too many of them so i don't mind doing links when there's not that many i'll, I'll definitely put them in for this this one okay so that's number one begin what have I got in here? Uh, this is, I think these are little animals for my granddaughter. So it's a little box. I can't open. So these are, she loves little animals. Now I brought jungle animals last time, but these are actually um, farmland as animals. So uh, not as good quality as the other ones. The other ones were a little bit bigger and a bit heavier. But these are super cute. Oh, she's going to love them. Little horsey. Little moo moo cow. So I'm going to give her one every day so that she can open them and have fun with them. Yeah, the other ones were that I brought from AliExpress were a bit more realistic. These ones are not as realistic. But it's got a little cow. She's gonna love this. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna buy dinosaurs because she's really into dinosaurs as well. Oh, and little pussycat and chickens and ducklings. And a little donkey. Super cute. And these were $12.77. So that was, yeah. You know, I thought that was really good value because they're usually, the other ones on AliExpress, they, I think they were about a dollar, dollar ninety each or two dollars, two euro. Same dollars, so you know what I mean. What is it? Um, uh, it's still haven't got used to saying euros. This is a choo choo train, so oh, I can't see the picture. Oh, here we go. I'll show you the picture. So, this has got can't remember what it's got. It's got anyway, it's got something. I can't remember what I, which one I ended up buying, but it's a choo choo train that connects together. Oh, it's animals, of course, because she loves animals. So, it basically is a little choo choo train that connects. A little penguin and she just pulls it along and i'll show you i'll do a little video separately at the end so that you can see i'll, I'll do it on the table so you can actually see me uh wheeling it along but very good quality very very good quality wow this is pretty she's gonna be wrapped with this one as well so she's gonna have heaps of fun while she's here and this was 8.69 euro okay i put together the little train set and let's see how it works so you just basically pull it along it's very cute so it holds together really well i think she'll like that choo 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 Yep, no trouble holding together. Oh, obviously, if you push back, it won't. Um, I like it as well, because if you try and connect it on the opposite um, magnet, it will it will not work. So if I, try, I think, if you try and connect it opposite, it, it repels itself. So you have to have it the right way, which is quite cute. And all the animals are going the right way, so she can learn about what's right and wrong as far as the um the animal has to be facing forward so i think it's very cute it's a cute toy so happy with that okay these are some wire snips i know why did i buy wire snips i know <laughs> but i saw them i thought oh really strong wire clips now why did i buy them because sometimes i want a piece of wire and i've got nothing to snip it with here and so let's have a look. I should put safety glasses on. Whoopsie. <laughs> Maybe this wire is too thick. That is not cutting at all. Okay. It's, it is cutting, but it's just not cutting easily and wrecking that okay let me see oh okay if you just press really hard 
Let me try that again. Let me see if I just stick it in there. Not easy. has not done a clean job of that. It feels really good in my hands. Maybe I could just use it for the garden. Mm, just says hold it straight and cut. Suitable for cutting iron, thin iron, copper and aluminium. Cannot cut metal wire. So maybe it's not supposed to cut this. So anyway, I particularly wanted something that would cut something like this that would be nice and sharp. Because um, I've got a little trick to show you guys with my sewing. And I'll do another little video hopefully soon uh, when I get back into my sewing room. I've got lots of guests coming, so I won't be doing that for a while. It, it looks amazing. So if you guys have got something smaller to cut, I think it's really worth it. But... So, um, let's see what comes out of this box. Okay, so this is something my husband ordered. Um, it is €13.99, Euro, and it is an itch healer. So it's fast, chemical-free treatment for insect, bite, insect bites and stings. Now, he gets really bad... Um, I suppose it's, I, I reckon it's an allergy to insect bites or, you know, like I get a bite, but it goes away straight away. I don't get itchy. It's very rare that I'll get itchy. Whereas he gets them really bad, like my daughter. They get really itchy and go crazy. Anyway, this apparently has got, um, you can heat your, like it heats. So if, say you've got a bite here, let's say that one there. You've got a bite and then you pop it on there and you can go to different heats. It heats up and it takes away the itch. Anyway, we'll try it out. Um, I am gonna try and do, you know, the best products and, and things like that um, that I've actually purchased from Timu. I've got quite a few that are really, really good that I highly recommend and some that are not so good. So I'll do one of those videos, but maybe at the end of this, I'll get my husband to try it out because, but he's away at the moment. He's actually in Berlin, heading to Berlin. So he's um, he's been, Dying to get this because he's got so many bites at the moment. So hopefully he can try it out straight away when we get back. And maybe at the end of this video, I can pop in um, what he thought of it. If not, I'll have to do a review separately. But anyway, that's for him. Okay, what else we got? Oh, got some little cars. I'll do a little review of this ones as well. So this is again for my granddaughter. I thought I've, I've got a, a mat upstairs from the landlord's child. Um, to, and it's got little tr tracks, so oh, they're very basic, very cheap, <laughs> cheap and nasty. Uh, do not recommend them. They're very. I thought, oh no, they do do pull. They are a pullback, so they do go, but they're very weak, very. Yeah, they're not like a matchbox car by any means, um, but they are a pullback and they do go. So I'll show you those on when I do the other videos um, at the end to show you what these toys are like and they're actually like the train when I do the train and the and the car and that was uh, $2.12 so you get eight cars one say there's about eight two four six eight ten cars so look cheap that's really cheap okay there's ten little cars here um, all different types they're a little bit plasticky they're not they're not very strong. They're not a matchbox car. They're very plasticky looking. Or not looking. Looking, they look actually quite good. It's just the, the, the lightness of them. They're quite light. But anyway, let's try them out. They work really well. Whoopsie. <laughs> it's gone flying off the table. So they work really well. I'll try and go a little bit. Not so. That's it. <laughs> That's good. It's landed on a soft chair. So they work really well. Really happy with them. Okay, what have we got here? Now this, I believe, yes, it's a plastic film cutter. And how much was this? $5.59. Now, oh my God, the, 
these things in Germany do not cut at all. It's got like a, a cutter thing here, it's plastic. It's rubbish, it's absolutely rubbish. It does not cut at all. Now it's gonna prove me wrong. But anyway, you basically pull it out, hold it down, and it just does not cut unless you go along. Oh, there you go. Unless you go along and hold each part of it. So I was so annoyed, especially when you get a big piece of plastic that you can't actually cut it. So I saw this and I thought, oh, I've got to get one of these for these little things. Now, I don't know if it's actually, oh, it's actually got, oh, it's actually got the container as well. Oh, super good. Wow. Oh, I'm going to love this now to try and open it. I always have trouble opening these things, don't I? Okay, this just has got a little button on the side, and I'm assuming you can just pull that out. Yeah, here it comes. Oh, really good. Super good. Okay, now I can put my little roll in there. Okay, it goes like that. And like that. Oops. In the, in the center there. Just popping it inside here. And then I'll pop this inside here. And that's voila. And I can pull it and hopefully go like that. And go like that. I think if it's on the table, it works a bit better. And cut. Oh, I had one of these in Australia. Well, no, I didn't have the container. I just had the top bit that you would just switch along to the different um, boxes. But this is really good. Super happy with that. Now, as long as that doesn't go in, I'm not sure which way I should be putting it, whether I should have it with the roll going that way or underneath, might switch it around actually. But yeah, super happy with that. Put that in my drawer and it's gonna be so much easier to cut. So that was a good buy. I'm really happy with that. Get rid of this plastic and boxes. Let's see what else I've got. I've got lots of little bits and pieces. This is a little jigsaw puzzle for my granddaughter. And it's got a little crocodile and it's just a little wooden. I'll try it out, see what the quality is like. Feels good, it looks good. And it's portable, so we can just oh no, I'm actually not gonna open it because she can open it. It was a dollar fifty, really a dollar fifty euro. Um, really cute. Yeah, really cute. It's got one, two, three, four, five. So she can look at the numbers, hopefully, and learn the numbers. And it's portable as well, so it's really quite small. So she, we can pop it in our bags and, and carry it when we're going on our cruise. Did I tell you I'm going on a cruise with them? So my granddaughter and I think I've mentioned it, but my son, my granddaughter are coming, and my daughter-in-law. Um, so now this is a shadow pad. Oh, so it's actually... So you pop, you've got the cards and then they just pop the, the little squares on them. This is really nice as well. So they can look at the shadows and see if she can pair it. So we'll, we'll be playing games, I'm sure, with her for that. That's really nice as well. So happy with that. And that was, so I've brought a few games for her. Uh, $6.74, €6.74. So that is super nice. Happy with that one. I think the toys have been good. Oops. Gotta be careful. Sometimes there's little bits in there. Okay. I've got this is to thread elastic in. Um I saw it. I've never I've never actually tried it yet. So it's here we go. It's one of these where you put the elastic in and you squeeze it in the elastic holes and then you can thread it through for things like um uh, cording, elastic, um, yeah. It says two openings and one closing belt thread. So, you know, when you're doing belting belts and things like that. So I've never tried anything like this. So we'll give it a go and see what it's like. So that's a um, uh, dollar, no, sorry, 99 cents. Now this one is 3.49. This is a pair of glasses, I think, from memory. Come on, my little sunnies. It's pretty cool. God, 
3.49. I went to, when I was in Sweden, I actually bought three pairs of glasses. I actually have them here, I'll show you. Uh, and they were like 70% off and I brought three. I've only got two here. The other ones are red, they're in my um, walking thing, but I really like these. They're really nice. And they really cut out the sun as well, so I really like those. They're nice. They're good for presents as well. I think I might buy those for my sister or something. She might not watch this, but she might watch it or she might not. Uh, these are my other glasses that I got for four euro uh, and they were 70%, 70 percent off, but I like these as well. And these, yeah, about the same. And these were originally, I don't know, I can't see without my glasses, <laughs> without my sunglasses. And these are the other pair. And there's another pair that I got with a bit more bling on the side as well. They look all right, don't they? But they, they weren't from Timmy. They were from a store in a Aileen's, I think it's called, uh, Orleans or something like that in Stockholm. Oh yeah, I'm really happy with those. Okay. Then next one in my scissors. Can't ever have enough scissors. I've got so many scissors. I'm I'm crazy. But these ones are really long. So when you're cutting a material that slips around, this is meant to be really good. And also if you're doing cards and you want to snip a really straight line, long handled um, scissors are really good. So let me see. Oh, actually, I might try and cut this plastic. Oh yeah, sharp as. And if I cut some paper, put some paper here. I shouldn't blunt them with paper if I'm gonna use them for fabric, but. Oh, very nice. And you can do really sharp lines when they're really long. So if you need scissors that are long, and I've been looking for these for quite a while. Um, they've got, there's a Tim Holtz, um, if you're a crafter, you would know Tim Holtz. Um, he's got a pair that are long like this, and I've been looking on Timmy for a while, and I finally found them. And they, uh, Tim Holtz is probably 30 euro, and these are 275, so I thought, give, can't go wrong, 275 euro. Some things are really good on Timmy, honestly. Anyway, what else have I got? Oh, this is, again, for my granddaughter. So uh, we don't have a high chair. Well, we actually have a high chair that the landlord left behind upstairs, uh, but it doesn't have um, a protection thing on the front. So I thought I would just get her something that we can strap her on. So this, I think, straps around the chair. Um, so, and then we've got a, um, you know, those chair, those seats that you put when the kids get older, booster seat. We've got a booster seat. So we thought we'd put that on, so on top of the, our dining chair and then put this around her and then that would, and we can also carry this when we're traveling. So I thought this would be better, or we're gonna put it on the high chair if we can get the high chair to, to work because it doesn't have a strap in the front. So we're gonna strap her in the high chair and then uh, if she makes a mess, it doesn't matter. Because my dining chairs have got material, so. But anyway, I thought that was really good. And this was, it wasn't cheap, $9, oh, it was cheap, $9.18. Um, feels like it's washable. And I'll show you a picture of it. Um, I'll post a little picture of that. So that's that one. Um, actually, I'll do the one that's good, I think. I don't even know what this is. $2.79. I've no idea what it is. I must have worked it out when I saw the pictures, but I can't remember what I brought. What is this? Oh, yes, I know what this is. So this is tape you put on your sewing machines, sewing machine, and it gives you quarter inch increments so that you can go straight on your sewing. So I'm gonna line it up on my sewing machine and I think it's like a washi tape so it doesn't ruin your sewing machine. So I'm gonna pop that on. That's really good. So, and that was $2.79, it wasn't cheap, um, but I'm sure like if you try and buy it elsewhere, it'd be so much more expensive. So I still think this is really worth the money. And now this is a beauty. <laughs> This is nipple covers. I thought that were going to be those things that you put on when you're not wearing a strapless dress or something like that and actually holds your, you know, your breast up. But this is definitely not what I was expecting. So, you know, you see on Facebook, you get all these, these ads for these things. And I thought they were going to, this does not, 
<laughs> does not cover, it just covers my nipple. <laughs> so, oh my God, it's not what I was expecting. Oh God, I am a beauty sometimes. So anyway, I brought those. <laughs> so that's my haul, guys. Um, it's always a pleasure to be with you guys and I love your, all your comments and your feedback. Um, love hearing what you think. Um, let me know if there's something that you'd like to see or if there's something I should change. Um, people have mentioned that I should change my name and I think it's a really good idea because I would like to grow this channel to be a little bit more and um, I need to get at least to a thousand subscribers. Well, I'd like to get over a thousand subscribers, but I need to get to a thousand subscribers. Then I can start maybe getting some people to sponsor me for some try-ons and things like that. That's what I'd like to keep doing. I'd like to keep doing try-ons because I love clothes. But anyway, um, that is my haul for the day. Thank you for being with me. I love every minute of being with you guys. Um, thank you again. And I want to love you and leave you. Ciao, ciao. Bye.